Uh, All right, we're going to start the uh, personnel committee meeting. Um, Alder Dorf will not be here tonight. She is ill. And we'll start out with the roll call. Alder Galvin is present. Alder Corpus Vax present. Alder uh, Cabby LaPave present. I'll entertain a motion on the agenda. I have a motion to approve. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. That passes unanimously. And I'll entertain a motion on the minutes. Motion to approve. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. That also passes unanimously. <coughs> on the regular business. Are we okay, Mel? Yep. Okay. Um, Number one, consideration with possible action on the request to fill the following replacement positions and all subsequent vacancies resulting from internal transfers. A is engineering technician for public works. B is a truck driver sanitation for public works. C is park maintenance worker for parks, recreation, and forestry. And D is a park superintendent for parks, recreation, and forestry. Staff? So you do have the request of fills in your packet if you have any questions about the positions. I have no questions. Anyone else have any questions? No. I'll entertain a motion. I'll make a motion to approve um, the transfer for the uh, following positions. Okay. Second. And all those in favor? Aye. Aye. That passes. Uh, number two, consideration with possible action to amend City of Green Bay Chapter 22 mm -hmm. dress policy to create a dress for your day policy. Staff. Yeah, so exciting stuff. Right. Dress for your day. Your, your day. day. Okay. Yeah. So we've talked a lot about improving the workplace experience for employees. Like last year, we've talked a lot about summer hours and flexible scheduling. And I think this is an extension of that where we're allowing our employees to be flexible and choose a appropriate work attire for the day. So what dress for your day is, is essentially that. You're dressing for your day. Where if you have um, scheduled meetings with external customers or vendors, you might want to wear more professional clothing. Whereas you have a day with less interaction, you might have more casual clothing. So this is this policy is put in place for the water utility at Green Bay, Green Bay Metro, and also Save Appleton. And I do think um, Save De Pere, I believe, is proposing this as well. So they've had all positive feedback. Um, and then the policy is intended for employees at City Hall and city office settings, and then not for employees that have a uniform or, up, or are up, out in the field. So what I included in this packet was the guidelines for Dress for Your Day, and then also our current uh, Dress Code policy. So if this was passed, it would be uh, effective March 16th of this year, and this would give us time to uh, educate our employees and answer any questions from employees and from the supervisors, and I guess give them some time to shop for maybe more casual clothes if they want to do that. Yeah, I read it more It sounds very <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We, uh, <coughs> If this does pass, could we review this, um, say in six months? Um, I'd be interested in seeing, you know, what, what the reaction has been, and then also, I mean, from the public, if there's any comments from the public, but also uh, the interaction with the employees and supervisors and such. Definitely. Okay. Yeah. And I, I think with all of our policies, we want to continue to do that and look at them throughout the year. You see if it needs tweaking or anything else like that? Yeah. Okay. So, as cops, is this? Beard thing, part of that dress for your day thing with the police department? No, but I think it's aligned with what we're trying to do with our employees. You know, yeah. Okay. Have a little bit more flexibility with the day. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Very good. I think. I don't, oh, that's go ahead. Go ahead. I don't find anything bad about it. I think it sounds very professional, and I think most businesses probably have the same type of, uh, you know, code for their employees too. Yeah. I just yeah. I'm fine with this. I think it's a good a good change. The only thing I'd like to see is where it says please avoid. I think um, I'd like to see not allowed or like clearly not allowed or okay not yeah, permitted right, versus right, like avoid. I, avoid to mm -hmm. me kind of says well <laughs> yeah. you don't say it can't have it. You're just saying okay. sure. try to avoid it. Yeah. 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 Any other comments? I would uh, entertain a motion with uh, uh, Alder Corpus Dax's uh, amendment. So moved. Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 That passes unanimously. So we'll, we'll make that change then, and you'll see it for the Common Council back. Okay. okay. <clears throat> All right, under informational uh, report of routine personal actions for regular employees, does anybody on the committee have any questions? I have not any questions. 
Okay, our next meeting date is March 10th, 2020. Motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. Motion to adjourn. All in favor? Second. Aye. 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 That passes unanimously. This meeting is concluded.